people like us. You are listening to People Like Us. I see you were hard at work last night. Hey, are you spying on me? No need to spy, Carol. It's clear to see for everyone who has eyes in their head. I'm not ashamed of what I do, Ma. You should be. You're engaging in all kinds of activities with all sorts of low-life men. It's a normal job. People have been doing this for centuries. That does not make it right. Why are you giving me such a hard time, Ma? We've always had a good relationship. Why does this change things? Because the work you're doing is disgusting and immoral. It's not disgusting. It's just work. We've cooked together. We've gone to church together. Those days are over. Why? This doesn't change who I am. It does in my eyes. As your landlady, I demand that you stop. Oh, what? You're going to evict me? You have no grounds to do that. I'll call the police. Tell them what you're up to. <gasps> Don't do that, please, ma. Then you better stop. You wanted to see me, Mr. Jacob. Sir, please. Unfortunately, your personal life is interfering with your job. You are suspended until further notice. I'm one of the school's best teachers. How I dress, whether I'm male or female, none of that reflects my teaching ability. You are setting a bad example for the pupils. By being brave enough to be myself? This isn't a discussion, Pumlani. How can we understand one another if we don't discuss things? There's a lot of pressure on me to fire you. I'm being lenient by suspending you until we can find a resolution to this matter. Please empty out your classroom. Mr. Jacob! That's my final word. Just give them a chance, Papa. I told you I can't, Galibo. Why on earth not? He's your son. I struggled for many years to understand Tapelo and his sexuality. I'm willing to meet him because he's family. But bringing his partner along, it reminds me he's living a life of sin. They are two men in love. That's all. And if I invite Uyapo into my home, what if the congregation finds out? I'm supposed to be their moral compass. But, but was it moral to kick Taps out of the house when he was just a kid? The Bible is very clear about these things, Galibo. I cannot condone any sin of any kind, even if it's family. Even if you think Taps is sinning, do you think it is moral to judge him because he's different from you? The difference is based on sinful behavior. This is your son we're talking about, Papa. He's not a bad person. Don't you want to see him happy? Miss mm, Garis. Cabo, look at you. Is that a new wheelchair? <laughs> Nurse Monica got me one from the clinic. It's not brand new, but ah, it's better than my old one. What are you doing? I'm packing up my things. Did you get fired? Temporary suspension, but I'm going to fight it. I deserve to be here. Some of the other kids are saying things behind your back. We can't do anything about other people's actions. We can just take responsibility for our own. It's just so unfair. I can't believe my dad did this. He's just doing what he thinks is right. But it's not right. We can't change who we are, Tharbo. But an opinion, that's something we can't change if we open our hearts and listen to each other. I hope so, Miss Garis. I really don't want you to leave. Pass me the salt, Ayanda. There's enough salt in the food, Monica. People have different tastes, Mama, with food and with men. Don't start that again. I think Eric is very handsome. Ma, stop it. I'm joking. You keep going on and on about Eric. Even though I told you, I'm not interested. I just hope that something will develop between the two of you. It won't, Ma. Because what? Tell Leander. Tell me what? I'm not interested in him, Ma. I'm not interested in men at all. Not right now, but... No, Ma. Never. I'm a lesbian. Don't be silly, Ayanda. I'm not joking. This is not how we were raised. We are African. That doesn't mean that. Is this because of some of the other girls at the college or because of something you've seen on TV or in magazines? No, Ma. It's who I am. It's who I've always been. I don't believe this. It's the truth, Ma. You just haven't met the right man yet, Ayanda. You'll change your mind. You'll see. People like us. For more stories like these, 
and to share yours. Visit unheardvoices.africa.